President Trump, let's take a look at these three terms. We'll simplify them and put them into proper bracket, step by step. Clarity is very important. Absolutely, PM Modi. I see it already. There's a number in front of the extract. Indeed. The first step is to multiply that number with the constant term at the end. Let us calculate that. Right. So we multiply. That gives us 18 simple math. I like it. Now we must find two numbers that multiply to 18. But when added together, they give us 11. Very crucial step. Easy 1 p.m. Modi, 9 times 2 is 18. 9 plus 2 is 11. That's a beautiful combo. Exactly. We got it right on the first attempt. Now we rewrite 11x as 9x plus 2x. Wait a second p.m. Modi. Why are we doing that? Just asking sounds good. Just want the logic. Ah, a great question, Mr. President. When we break it like that, we can group the terms. And once we group, we might find common elements, something we can factor out. Got it. So we're simplifying each group. I see 9, X and 6 have a 3 in common and 2X and 3. Well, we can't pull much, but the expression might repeat. That's good. Very observant. From the first pair, we take out 3X. From the second, we can take 1. That leaves us with 2X plus 3 inch, both parts. There it is. 2X plus 3 shows up twice. We love consistency. So we've got 3X plus 1 times 2X plus 3, right? Yes, that is the final factorized form, a perfect expression. Just like diplomacy, algebra needs precision and collaboration. Couldn't agree more PM Modi. We just made math great again.